And I know you've talked a lot, Joel, about trying to you know win that first inning and then you know try to carry it on from there. And that was a great start getting those three runs. Yeah, anytime you can you know, obviously get ahead. And in and, and, and this series, that was kind of the the way it all went, and for both clubs. And uh, uh, and tonight uh, was no different. And. Uh, you know, as a starting pitcher, I'm sure that you know having those runs enables him to uh, not relax, but it enables him to tack the, tack the strike zone, and that's what he did, and that's what he did. Jolson and the guys were very determined tonight to get the bats back after the two hitter that they got tossed against them last night. Yeah, that's just baseball, you know. Their, their guy two nights ago was really good, and and and, and that's what happens. I mean, he struck out 14, but uh, uh, tonight again we we got ahead early and. Uh, and uh, pushed a couple across later, which obviously helped seeing what the outcome was of the score, and uh, uh, very pleased. Defense was good in the game, too. Uh, Carlos made some nice plays out there. I mean, just like yes, he did. The, the one play that really uh, was Zaleski with the comebacker and, and getting the double play, Carlos coming across the bag like he did very aggressively, and uh, uh, that, was, uh, that was a big moment in the ball game in the middle of the game. Uh, Joel, talk about that little bit of a hairy ninth inning there. You know, every ninth inning, you know, you're never safe, and, and that's, this is a great game, and that's that's one thing that that comes along with it. And uh, again, we we bent a little bit, but we didn't break. And uh, our guys, you have to give them credit. And uh, Rodriguez came in and got some two big outs, obviously for us. And uh, especially after giving up a broken bat single uh, through the hole there, and he didn't lose his composure. He he went right after the hitters and used all his pitches. It was good to see for that young man. Joel, how satisfying from the standpoint of everybody contributed. You know, the great. Pitching, the timely hitting, and then the great defense. Yeah, and, and I think that that's just you know this. If you look at this ball club, what they've done in the past, and and, and you know they believe in each other, and and uh, when the guys throw strikes and do the things they're supposed to do on the mound, it just makes everything else work that much better. And uh, uh, again, the defense tonight was was big. We got a couple of huge double plays. Joel, talk about the fact that I know that it's uh, good to have your guys in a playoff situation because that certainly gives them experience when things are tight and you're playing for all the marbles. Yeah, I think that the important thing is, you know, you, you, in playing in a winning situation, it just it, it, it makes it fun for the guys. You know, they come to the ballpark and they, they go out there and they prepare themselves and they do all the things they have to do prior to a ball game and go out and, 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 and do the things they do. And, and then you look up after nine innings and see what the outcome is. And that's the way this group's done it all year. And uh, as a result, they've, uh, they've done a great job of, of getting ready to play and, and have played well. Can you preview the Pawtucket series for us? Not really. Uh, they were just here in town, but the rosters and all the differences in, uh, is, is very fluid. They were here before September 1st, right at the last weekend, so I'm sure that the, there's uh, some differences in rosters just like there is in ours, and, and that's part of it. That's uh, September baseball in AAA, and, and uh, so we'll go up there and, and try and uh, do our best at what these guys are capable of doing and, and go from there. Greg, I see you. I uh, just uh, knew he was going to try to, you know, come with something in just because he was missing away the, the past two guys, and I was just trying to look for something up and uh, put a good swing on. Luckily, I got one. You guys set the tone earlier. Really, nice success this year has been built on getting an early lead. Mm -hmm. How important was that tonight, getting those five balls? I mean, it was big. I mean, if you looked at the series, uh, the team that scored first won every game. So you want to, you definitely want to punch first. Uh, it was, it was big for Z to get that that first zero in the first inning. But um, getting three runs in the first, that was that was definitely big. Kind of takes the air out of them. Great defense in this game as well. And Z had a great play at the, in the fifth inning. Mm -hmm. How much does that fire you guys up going back into the dugout? Oh, it's awesome. I mean, um, you know, not only does it, you know. You know, pump everybody up, but you know it's good for the team just because we get out of the inning. You know that was a big situation. You know they they we uh, cut them to only one run, and if they get more than one run, you know then the last inning is a little bit more uh, in intense. So you know that's definitely big when we get a big play like that. Impressive start from Matt, of course. Uh, pitches into the ninth inning. We'll talk about the, the performance of him tonight. Yeah, you know he's a he's a veteran guy. He's always one of those guys that's gonna you know give you a great great uh, outing and. Uh, you know, he was working both sides of the plate and keeping their guys off balance. And, I, you know, I felt sorry for him. I'm glad I wasn't facing him.
Greg, talk about the fact you were DHing for a while there, but back in right field. Obviously, you'd rather be out in the outfield, I'm sure, than DHing, right? Oh, yeah, obviously. I mean, you know, uh, the past few years have been a defensive replacement. So, uh, you know, for me to not, you know, play defense, that was, a, that was a change. But I started getting used to it a little bit, but it was definitely good to, you know, have a sweat going the whole game and not have to go do jumping jacks in the tunnel or something before my at-bats. How impressed are you that you've had you know, five or six guys to line up tonight that weren't with us opening day, but to continue to win, how impressive is that? I mean, it says a lot to our pitching, really. I mean, that's I feel like that's been one of our strengths the whole year, you know, our pitching and our bullpen. And, um, you know, for the younger guys, you know, you can tell when we're in the cage or in the, in the clubhouse that, you know, they are young, you know. So it's it's easy for them to stay loose and not, not take too much off, uh, you know, out of it. But, I mean, it's, it's definitely um, speaks a lot to, you know, the White Sox organization having these young guys coming in. You guys had nearly a, a two-hour delay uh, with the weather, of course. Tough to get out there and get started early on. I mean, you guys didn't show, of course, get the runs early. Uh, I mean, you know, uh, at the beginning of the game, it's kind of hard to see. So we, we actually kind of liked it, you know, starting with, you know, the lights on and it being dark. So uh, it, the, the hardest thing, I guess, for the pitcher, just because, you know, they got to get, you know, get going and get warm. So uh, the two-hour delay wasn't too bad. We got to play cards and, you know, kick it in the clubhouse a little bit. Greg, how's it feel for you and the guys? You're going to the International League Final Championship. There'll be a lot of people in baseball with their eyes on you and the guys. Oh yeah, it's going to be awesome. I mean, uh, we 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 when we won the, the South, you know, we we kind of set forth the idea of you know we can win this whole thing, and we took a, a couple blows with call ups and guys um, not being here anymore. But um, obviously, you know, I guess we showed that we can we can play with anybody right now. That was a you know they had the best record in the league, so. Um, you know, playing Pawtucket, we just played them, and they have pretty much the same team that that we had last time. So we like our chances.